Hello, Kules, and welcome back to Viva Barca. Welcome to the home of everything Barcelona, where we are going to be discussing the latest developing stories. We start with Alejandro Bade, as it has been reported that Luis Enrique is seriously considering naming the Barcelona young star in Spain's World Cup squad. We are going to be discussing on that as we move ahead. Then secondly, talking about Memphis Depay, as it has been reported that the Barcelona forward wants to leave in January. He wants to leave for free in the January transfer window. We are also going to be looking at that. So guys, before we get right into it in much detail, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. With the FIFA World Cup 2022 only a matter of days away, Spain manager Luis Enrique will name his squad for the tournament on November 11, Friday. According to Sport, La Roja head coach is seriously considering including Barcelona starlet Alejandro Bade on the list. The 19-year-old defender is enjoying a fine breakthrough campaign at Barca, where he has not only established himself as the first-choice left-back, but has also been preferred ahead of Hector Bellerin in the right-back position. The teenage prodigy is soon expected to start negotiations over a new contract with the Catalan Giants, given that his current one expires in 2024. Bade has not played for the Spanish national team yet, but has reportedly been included in Enrique's 55-man provisional list for the World Cup. And now, the aforementioned report is stating that Lucho is seriously considering the prospect of naming the left back in the final 26-man list that will fly to Doha for the quadrennial tournament. Enrique has Jordi Alba and Jose Gaia as his primary options for the left back position, while Cesar Aspilicueta and Dani Cavajal are the first choice players at right back. However, none of them quite offer the same level of explosiveness that Bade brings to the table. On top of that, the Barcelona young star's versatility further earns points in his favour. Enrique will announce his squad on Friday and will wait until the last minute to make his final decision, which will be based on the current form of the players. In such a scenario, Bade has a lot going for him to be on the plane to Qatar this week. Other Barcelona players like Sergio Busquets, Pedri, Gavi, Ferran Torres and Alba are certain to be included. As for Anto Fati and Marcos Alonso, their involvement seems doubtful at this point. What a season Alejandro Bade have had and I think he should be included on the list going to the World Cup. He has been phenomenal. I think this season he has been the breakthrough player for Barcelona and one of the breakthrough players in Europe that have catched the eyes of many football fans. Um, so Spain will release their final 26-man list for the World Cup, the squad list for the World Cup. And according to this report, Luis Enrique, the Spanish national team manager, is seriously considering naming Barcelona young star Bade in his Spain's World Cup squad. Of course, it wouldn't be surprising if Bade is being named there because I think he has earned a spot to be there. From his performances this season, I think he deserves to be there. Um, the World Cup is soon coming. Of course, many players will soon be traveling to, their rest, um, to Qatar um, with their national teams. And of course, it will be a trophy that everybody will want to see how it plays. Um, Barcelona played their last game um, before the break, which we won in a dramatic fashion. Two goals to one away at Osasuna, despite being 10 man down since, the, 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 I think, the first half. Um, it was a great way for us to to go into our break, into the long break. And of course, we hope that after the World Cup, Barca continue the way they have been playing in La Liga, where we are topping now, currently with five points difference, um, pending a game in hand when with, um, with Real Madrid. So it's going to be interesting. So I think for Barca's case, talking about including him in the World Cup squad, it is something that I am expecting Luis Enrique to do because definitely I think the kid has earned his spot. He has been 
playing so well this season and he deserves to at least fly to Qatar even if he goes there not being a starter all the time because well they have other world-class left backs there you know at least he should be there in that squad list you know to, to even make up the bench so let's see how it's gonna look like um according to the report Luis Enrique will will name his walk of squad tomorrow Friday the 11th of November that was that's when you make the official announcement of the players that will be included in his squad list that will travel to Qatar for the FIFA World Cup. So let's see how it's going to be. Then on to the next story of discussion. It seems like Memphis Depay's time at Barcelona could soon be coming to an end. The Netherlands international had found game time had to come by by the start of the ongoing campaign and had been, been sidelined with an injury since September. Barca have played their final game before the World Cup break and will return to action on New Year's Eve when we face local rivals RCD Espanyol and it is unclear whether the pie will be a part of the man of Xavi's plans by that time. Memphis Depay had fallen out of favor. Mr. Roman had made just three appearances before his injury and Barca have reportedly been contemplating the option of moving him on the winter window. Now, as relayed by Sport, the pie himself has asked the club to let him leave on the free transfer in the January transfer window, with Manchester United and Tottenham all monitoring his situation. It is no secret that the Netherlands striker was close to leaving Barcelona for Juventus in the summer window until a deal fell through. Furthermore, Pierre Merigo Bamayang's late move to Chelsea dented any hopes of his exit. However, the pie wants to resurrect his career after struggling for game time at Spotify Camp Nou this season and does not wish to wait until the summer to do so. Hence, he has asked Barca to sanction an exit in the January transfer window. It is reported that the 28-year-old wants Barca to grant him a letter of freedom and allow him to leave for free like they were planning to do in the summer this development has seemingly alerted two clubs in england in the form of manchester united and tottenham the red devils know memphis Depay very well given that he had a stain there at old trafford in the past albert a largely forgettable one meanwhile tottenham had been linked with a move for the dutchman during the summer although nothing materialized if the Vatatai forward will be available for free in January, the two clubs would likely be interested in the move, the report of Clay. It all depends on Barca whether they are willing to let him leave for nothing, even though he still has six months left on his contract. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.